In this tutorial, I'd like to show you how to use the doorway transition. Doorway simulates doors opening up to your next clip. I'm in Final Cut Pro 10. This transition also works in motion and After Effects as well. I've got some clips loaded up on my timeline. I'll open up the Transitions browser, click on FX Factory Pro, and locate the doorway transition. I can skim over it and get a nice preview of what doorway does. I'll drag it onto my cut. I'll press Ctrl D to change the duration and type in one second. In the info pane, you'll see the first thing that we can adjust is the type of the transition. Swing and slide, or slide only. I like the swing with the slide, so I'll keep it set to the default. I'll slightly adjust the sliding range setting, which changes how much the opening doors slide. We can have the opening be vertical or horizontal. You can turn reflections on or off. I like them on, but I'll adjust the opacity and distance from the reflection to make it more subtle. My favorite parameter is starting focus, which allows you to make the incoming clip out of focus at the start, which gives you a nice depth of field effect. 100% is completely in focus. I'll adjust this down slightly to add some blur. Doorway will draw a gradient under the two clips if you'd like. Standard gradient controls allow you to adjust it to taste. A quick gradient tip. I'll set my gradient end to a dark midnight blue. Then I'll drag the color chip into the gradient starting color setting to use it as a starting point. I'll click it and use the luminance slider in the color picker to choose a slightly lighter version of the same color. Lastly, I'll set motion blur to on for added realism. You can see the different resolutions of the blur as I change the quality setting from low to medium to high. Doorway adds a cool dynamic transition to your toolkit. Doorway is included in the FX Factory Pro set of plugins. FX Factory offers a huge set of filters, transitions, and generators. And if you don't have them yet, go try them out at noiseindustries.com.